All right, Wednesday morning, time to roll. Got a cold start here in Chicago, negative eight degrees, so hope you're staying warm where you're at. However, for the first time in it feels like a while, we've got a warm start in the market. Got a lot of green on the screen this morning, so equity indices are higher. Dow Jones up by nearly 400. That's a 1% move. S&P's up 65, 1.5% move. NASDAQ up 300, a big 2% move. Again, yesterday, another wild roller coaster session where we had markets, Dow Jones most notably down about 800 points, turns around, we finished today 60 or so lower in the Dow. Uh, S&Ps yesterday, we finished lower by uh, about 50, still down 1% in the NASDAQ, we were down over 2%. So wild swings in a number of stocks. We've got Tesla reporting after the market closed today. We had Microsoft report yesterday. Microsoft is up uh, nearly 5% in the pre-market, giving these markets a bit of a bump. So just absolute chaos lately and some great volatility, which provides some great trading opportunities in that price action. Now, today's a big day. Why? Because it's the Federal Reserve. Their two-day meeting's wrapping up today, 2 o'clock Eastern time. We'll get that policy announcement. No, expectation is no change in policy. However, looking to see if we can glean some insights as to when the Fed's going to start raising rates. So markets heading into that, you look at some of these other markets like, that, like FX, we're still seeing some dollar strength, albeit this morning a bit quieter. Uh, most notably, we're seeing strength against the euro. And then over in oil, we're seeing a big jump in oil with these Russia-Ukraine tensions firing up. Oil's up uh, nearly 2% this morning, trading at $86 a barrel or over $86 a barrel, just shy of $87 a barrel. All right, folks, a lot going on. A lot of great opportunities out there. A lot of price action to trade. It's going to be a big day. Let's get in there, trade it up. I'll see you folks again tomorrow.